Hi guys, welcome to Cheryl's Home Cooking. I just realized that all three of these cans are different ounces. This one's 15 ounce. This one's 14.5. And this one is 15.25. And looking at the cans, to me, they all look the same, but they're not. So for my chicken pot pie, what I'm going to do is I'm going to drain all three cans. I have four medium-sized potatoes on the stove. I'll let them boil and then I'll cut them down into bite size. I have 10 chicken tenders. I'll wait till that water boils and the chicken is cooked and then I'll dice that into bite sizes. I have one 26 ounce can of cream of chicken. I'll put that in a pan and then mix it with a half a can of milk. So everything is kind of pre-cooked. Then I'll place it in my 350 degree oven for about 20 to 30 minutes or until the biscuits are nice and golden brown. I'm using a can of biscuits. There's eight of them in here. What I'll do is I'll cut them up, put a little butter on them, and then place them on top of all my ingredients in my 10 by 14 baking pan. Instead of the milk, I'm using heavy whipping cream, so I'm using half a can of heavy whipping cream, and then I'll mix that in with the cream of chicken. Now I'll place this on my stove. So my potatoes are starting to boil. Still waiting on the chicken. And here's my cream of chicken soup with the heavy whipping cream. I added in a tablespoon of dry parsley and a teaspoon of onion powder. So I'll mix this in. I have my burner on medium. I'll add in a little bit of pepper, about a teaspoon. Now I'll mix that in. I'll give that about five minutes and then I'll take it off my burner and add in my vegetables. I drained my vegetables, so now I'll add these vegetables to the cream of chicken soup. You want to blend it all in. 
I'm still waiting on my potatoes and my chicken. So I'll put my lid on. My potatoes are done, so now I'll drain them. I have my potatoes on my plate. They're still steaming. I'm going to try to cut them into bite-sized pieces while they're this hot. I'm using my new knife. It's a Tomodachi. Hopefully I'm saying the name correctly. So I'll be slicing my potatoes with my new knife. This knife works really, really good. I didn't even have to touch the potatoes. I cut them all into bite-sized pieces, so now I'll add that into my cream of chicken soup. You want to blend it all together. This looks really good. This is quick and easy. The only thing you have to wait for is the biscuits once it's in the oven. And you would have your oven preheated at 350 for about 20 to 30 minutes or until the biscuits are nice and golden brown. I'm still waiting on my chicken. So now I'll put my lid back on. Chicken is boiling, I'm just waiting for it. I have the whole set of the knife set. I like when they come with these little covers. And this was the knife I was just using for my potatoes. I hand wash them. They slide off and on really easy. It's really a good knife set. I got them a couple years ago at Sam's Club. And hopefully I'm saying the name correctly, Tomodachi. So if you're interested in this knife set, I'm sure Sam's Club may still have it, or you can just go to maybe the Tomodachi's website. They're really good knives. So my 10 chicken tenders are done. Now I'll slice them up. If you don't have chicken tenders, you could use two chicken breasts. Now I'll cut the tenders into bite-sized pieces. Now I'll add in the bite-sized pieces into my cream of chicken soup. This is so simple and easy to make, quick too. That's the last of the chicken. Mm. 
Once it's all mixed, then I'll pour it into my casserole dish. Now I'll take this mixture and put it in my casserole dish. Now I'll mix it around. Doesn't that look good? Now I'll get my biscuits, cut my biscuits up, put a little butter on top of my biscuits, and put it in my 350 degree oven for about 20 to 30 minutes or until the biscuits are nice and golden brown. And then your chicken pot pie is done. I have one stick of melted butter, a tablespoon of parsley, and I put in some pepper. So I'll stir that around. Now my butter is all melted. I'll take my biscuits and cut them and place them in the butter. I'll mix them around and then place them on top of my casserole dish that I have all my vegetables in. So you place this in your 350 degree oven for about 20 to 30 minutes. You want to wait until the biscuits turn a nice golden brown and then it's done. So into the oven it goes. About halfway through check the biscuits and then flip them over so the other side browns as well. So I just got done flipping them. So I'll wait another 10 minutes and they should be golden brown. So it's been 30 minutes that I had it in the oven, 15 on each side for the biscuits. I put a little in my plate. I'll give it a try. The biscuit is nice and crispy too. So now I'll try it. Mm mm mm. Really good. Mmm, this was really good, quick and easy. Well, thanks so much for tuning in to another episode of Cheryl's Home Cooking and Watching Me Make My Chicken Pot Pie. I'll see you guys next video. Bye-bye.